Hi, welcome to my channel, Raven's Enchanted Tarot. This evening I'm reading for Leo, so this is going to be for Leo, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, Sun, Cross Watchers, you're welcome here as well. This is going to be for April 1st through to the 14th. Take what resonates and leave the rest, it's not for you. I am doing a free tarot card reading giveaway. This is going to be a full yearly forecast reading. All you have to do to be in with a chance to win is like, comment, share, subscribe. Let me know in the comment section you've done that so that I can communicate with you and let you know that you was possibly chosen at random for the free yearly reading. I'm doing this for every single star sign reading that I'm doing for the month of April. And the private readings currently not taking none at the moment, hence the reason why I'm doing the free giveaways. So like, share, comment, subscribe for your chance for a free 12 month tarot card reading. So let's deal with why you came here, shall we, Leah? Let's get some cards out, see what's going on for Leah, April 1st through to the 14th. issues you know that for the ones that this is going to resonate with wow yeah definitely got some issues but brand new beginning ace of coins the energy to read above all of this is the ace of coins gifts money a gift from the universe something that is going to change your life this is this is a magnificent change i'm going to leave that in the upright position to oversee this this reading but this wow then the nine of coins underneath wow that is amazing this shit, whatever's going on, is disappearing. It's make it's gonna make its way out. So first card we have is the chariot reversed, sign of cancer. This could be feeling like you're not going anywhere. You're stuck in a situation and you're in over your head and it just feels out of control. It feels out of control. You don't know where you're going, you don't know where your destiny is. But some of you may feel quite trapped. You want to run away. You want to get away, but you can't. Something is out of control. Strength reversed. Mental and physical exhaustion. This is your card. You're not in your energy right now. And there's a lot of ego here. You're dealing with someone who's very, very egotistical. And it's draining the motherfucking life out of you. Control. Someone's got control issues. And it's got out of hand. It's got way out of hand. King of Swords, Libra, Gemini, Aquarius. Someone who comes across quite cold, very callous, very mean. You could be dealing with someone in the, the law as well, a law official, police, lawyer, something like that. But this is a very cold, callous individual. This is someone who doesn't deal with emotions, doesn't care about emotions. Very, very factual. Princess of Cups reversed at the bottom underneath this chariot reverse, sir. Uh, this is someone's, it could be a Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces. Their emotions are just all over the place. They're fake as fuck. This is someone who is not real. This is someone who pretends to be all psychic and awakened and, oh, my third eye's open and all that crap. And no, is it fuck? You've just been watching too many TikTok videos. Or this is someone who picks up a couple of crystals and proclaims that they're a witch. No, they're not. This isn't somebody who can see into the future, who is spirit, spiritually enlightened. This is someone who's just fake. Fake, full of themselves, likes to make up lies, likes to manipulate, likes to copy people's behaviours. This is a, a copier. Let's get some clarification. What's the chariot reversed for Leo, please? Chariot reversed for Leo. Oh, that's reversed, yeah. So strength reversed for Leo, please. See, I don't like to see your energy reversed. Oh, is that reversed as well? Oh, King of Swords. What is this King of Swords, please? Oh, wow. And the Princess of Cups reversed. Jesus Christ, Leo. Got that King of Swords on the bottom again. Well...
Purge of cups reversed over the chariot. There's no love here. It's fake. If there was love here, it's fake. This is someone who's extremely immature. They tried to offer you something, but it was a half cup. It was it was it was a half ass promise. Whatever it was that someone came in and tried to offer you. It was so full of shit. Three of Swords, cheating, betrayal, lies, deception, everything and anything that can cause ma major heartache. And this has hit you hard. This is you finding out about not just one, maybe multiple people. Because we've got another female here. We've got two females. And you've possibly found out about them. Someone who likes to manipulate, manipulate circumstances to suit their needs. And these females are just as unhappy as you are because they all know about each other as well. And maybe, you know, they want to stay blind to it. They want to stay dumb. They want to play the fool to some dick. Queen of Wands reversed, angry, hot-tempered, just as much as a fair cast person as this Princess of Cups reversed. They d they're not very motherly. They're not very organised. They haven't got the shit together. Um, one's angry and feisty and one's overly emotional fake they're both just ugh, drama 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 I've got the five of ones over this princess of cups it's reversed so wherever this this piece of shit goes drama isn't too far behind this is someone who likes to be in the middle of chaos they like to be in the middle of drama and both of them seem to think that they're gonna win or they're gonna bag this man or and, and in reality, if this is your situation, then they're taking some piece of shit off your hands. They're cleaning your dog shit out your garden. Let them have it. Because you've got a brand new future that awaits you. You're going to be single. You're going to be independent. You're going to be financially secure. You don't need this drama. You don't need this shit. Final outcome for Leo. Yeah. There's a reason that this gentleman or this this woman is attracted to you and that's because you're very stable you're very grounded you're very courageous and you're not as easily manipulated as these other people you may think you are but you're not leo you're not giving yourself enough credit you've lost too much as it is you've given away too much of your power too much of your time too much of your finances you've been manipulated from your own future but I don't see you standing for it any longer. I do see you standing up for yourself. Cut off the communication, spirit saying. You need to cut off the communication. Because it's just, yeah, the emperor reversed. Wow. Major, major control issues. Egotistical, narcissistic. And this person has hurt you multiple, multiple times. But look at this. Ace of coins again and the queen of coins. You're a mother, you're a family person or you're a father. You're a homemaker. To have two aces in a reading and then a nine of coins and a queen of coins, you have got your shit together and people see that and they want a piece of that. And unfortunately, someone has managed to take a bit of a bigger piece than I'd like to say they have. This is someone who did not deserve your time, did not deserve your energy, did not deserve to be in your company. And it's exhausted you. It has completely exhausted you. It's wiped you out. Because you can't believe you accepted this half-assed offer in the first place from this scum. Because they're very clever, they're very good at the words, they're very good at communication, they're very good at manipulating you. As soon as you get away from this situation, you are walking into a shitload of money and a brand new future, Leo. You have no idea. You're strong, you're fierce, you're independent, you do not need this. This is just, this is just muddy waters. Darkness. I, f I feel like this is where you feel like you are right now. You just don't know what to do with yourself. This is the long night. This is a long night. This is entering um, a time of, of introversion. It's learner time. It's time for you to turn inward and, and you need to plan. You need to strategize. It's time to do some shadow work. If you don't know what that is, go and have a Google. But it's the stuff that we don't like to deal with. But unfortunately, we have to. Because that's what keeps attracting this. Um, you know, by doing the shadow work, this is going to bring in some big dividends later on. This is what these aces are. The universe is dying to bring this in. 
you need to just release what no longer works for you. Release past pain, release past traumas. You may need to go right back into your childhood and start dealing with things that you tried to be fierce and strong about and that you thought you could get over or you could deal with. It's time to deal with them now because this is why you keep attracting the wrong people. Because it's almost like the universe is saying, we don't quite think you've learnt your lesson yet because you've not quite acknowledged what's going on or what's happened. By acknowledging it and dealing with it and dealing with the shadow side, you, you're going to allow this massive brand new opportunity and inflow of money, financial stability, everything you need to move forward and get away from this shit, Leo. I'll leave the reading there. Let me know in the comments section if this resonates. Like, share, subscribe. Keep your kitchen witch happy by giving me a big thumbs up and I'll see you all again soon.